Messiah chapter 29 verse 11 is a wonderful promise of God for his people. It says, I know the plans that I have for you, the plans to prosper you and to give you an expected end. This word was said to the children of Israel when they were at the lowest. It was given to them when they were held in captivity. To the children of Israel, at the time they received this word, they have lost hope. They think there is no future for them. And I believe at that point, they might have been saying to themselves, God has forgotten us. They might have been asking, where is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob? But in the midst of all they are going through, God remembered them and he sent a word to them. I have a plan for you. Maybe you are feeling like that. In all that is going around the world and you think God has forgotten you. I want to tell you that God has a plan for you. Hear what God says to you. In Isaiah chapter 49, verse 14 and 15 says, But Zion said, The Lord has forsaken me, and my Lord has forgotten me. 15 says, Can a woman forget a nursing child and not have compassion on the son of a womb? Surely they may forget because they are women, they are human. But God said, Yet I will not forget you. I don't know what you are going through right now. I don't know what you are experiencing right now. But I want to tell you, God has not forgotten you. The plans of God still stand. His promises still stand. God is a faithful God. He will work it out. You might not know how. Just keep on waiting and hoping on Him. He will make sure that His word come to pass in your life. God has not forgotten you. I pray that you will continually remember the promise of God for you. The great plans that He has for you and that He has not forgotten you. Until we meet again, I am Apostle Solomon Magnus of Abanda Life Ministry, Namibia. God bless you. Shalom.